Yes, yes. At the roundabout, all oh, right. We're yeah, just just shy of that here, Lisa. Can't quite see because they've done trees. Oh look! <laughs> oh yeah. How much is at the roundabout? Yeah. Oh my goodness me! Oh, this is that, guys. This is that. Oh my God, there she is. Oh my goodness, dear. Oh, everyone cheers, look, there she is. Oh, look, there, guys, there. There's a Majesty. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Shit. Shit, guys. Oh, I'm sorry, guys, I'm the best at this. Look at her, there she goes. Oh. Oh. They, Bill got a great view. Absolute great view, Bill. Good on ya. Oh my goodness me. Sorry guys. Goodness me, oh look, have I got numbers on them? Alright, okay. Well, oh, sorry guys, I'm terrible with this, isn't it? Gee whiz. Look, here they are here as well. Oh my goodness. Whoa, look. Number 12. 13 in the ambulance. Oh, oh my goodness, look. Never seen the likes of this. Whoa. Here she goes. Up the Pfeiffer Road. <laughs> she was. Not gonna leg guys. That was actually quite emotional there. Just a bit of nervous energy. Shit. They just keep coming, look at this. Where's Kate? Yeah. I guess there's the normal cars coming now, yeah, that's it. That's it, look, farewell, your majesty, I'll tell you now. You did what you thought was right each and every time, whether it was, that was uh, debatable, but... Hurrah, my darling. Hurrah. Guys, I'm going to end it there. Sorry, I haven't been the best cameraman. I do apologise. Take care, okay? And uh, catch you later. Hi, Uncle Tom. Take care, okay? See you later, everyone.
Sun in there, one zero eight, Delta Delta zero five four. Uh, the Sunday District Press, uh, Sunday Net. Uh, we've got zero one one already, and I've got Sean there for Scalp Radio. Any other stations like to call in? Please uh, go ahead. Okay. Shout out there, Millie. Uh, just call in your call sign there, buddy. Hi, uh, zero eight zero Millie. Zero eight Delta Delta. Zero eight zero Millie. Good afternoon, mate. How are you? Uh, Roger, that's just approaching the small roundabout now there, Roger. Roger. Well, under the underpass, heading towards it. Uh, I was telling them there's a day it was about the Queen. 10-4, I know they're doing a live stream just now. Uh, well, hopefully uh, nothing gets worse from uh, these days. Sorry, just go again with that there, mate.
Mike, uh, you were right the first time, that's 054, John. Oh, negative, uh, whiskey six, whiskey alpha radio, uh, Sean, Sean, uh, is doing the uh, security. Roger. Okay, Sean, that's Sean, that's Sean, that's I'm 
Schalt wieder. Ja, wer? Nina hat 7, 7, 1, Tana. Mike, the audio is fantastic.
the uh, Roger Bar and the, um, yeah, I can just barely make him out. I'm not able to have a QSO though. Um, Delta Delta Zero Two One from Delta Delta Zero Five Four. Go ahead. Making it back there, uh, Andy. Could you check that for me? What's so on? Yeah, what's the Ian? It's two eight three. I'm not hearing them there. I'm not sure when they're flanking or not. Could you maybe? Are you hearing uh, zero two one there? Keep. Thanks very much, Ian. Uh, yeah, Q, K, Q, R, Z. Right, good afternoon, John, and everybody. Delta, Delta, zero five two, just checking in. Um, yeah, so I've uh, just been watching the footage of the Queen's procession through Dundee, listening to amateur guys on Delta, on Delta, Delta for Operation Unicorn. So yeah, all good. So yeah, just saw again on the log. I'm still on the home twenty, just. Hi, good afternoon, Colin. Good to hear you, mate. Uh, yeah, uh, Roger, there. Well, I think everybody else is watching live streams for that as well. You know, you got up uh, there. It's a bit of a so we'll be heading to the past shortly, yeah. All uh, right, right, OK. Uh, yeah, there's a uh, few people come on so far, but yeah, pretty quiet so far, Colin. But are you going out to the mobile today? Fuck you. QSL, yeah. Just went ahead out the door in five minutes. Just got, uh, just getting a hot cup of coffee sorted out for in the car, and yeah. Uh, 
Hotel's a problem. That's between passing the horn. <laughs> it's a bit weird. Uh, but, uh, yeah, it's 052 calling. I'm going to ask you something there. I was going to ask you. I was going to ask you. Nah, it's escaped me. Must have been a lie, that's what they say. Yeah, so the, the Queen's got the horn in effect. But we'll better not say too much more about that. Aye, uh, well, if you remember, you could always run it by me. <laughs> Once you get up the hill, if you remember what you were going to ask. I do remember. I remember the thing you started saying that was a lie. Well, OK, so maybe it's not a lie then. On you go then. 7, 8, that was mentioning the modulation on your mobile radio. Excuse me, I'll go, uh, go again with that. Sorry, John, to me hear what you said there. DB, 21 guns. You mentioning the modulation on your mobile radio on sideband. It's got a bit of like, a, a noise to it. Oh, has it? I've never heard that report before, no. And, yeah, I've heard it too, but he, he noticed that when he was right next to you, uh, it would uh, make sure it's, like it's like you're in a helicopter noise. Uh, yeah, that, that's just proximity thing. I get that with code and certain other strong people in Dundee, I get that noise for you guys. Eh? And I think we spoke about that before. I've, tuned, I've had to tune off, you know what I mean? A lot of times with code and these other people. And if he's right next to me up the wall, that's just going to happen, isn't it? Yeah, Roger. That's what I thought, like, initially, but, uh, yeah, no, it's uh, just interesting subject, like, we're saying on about microphones, kind of handheld mic. I was going to suggest maybe you took another handheld mic with you. Roger, I do have a spare handheld mic. Yeah, I could swap that over. Uh, yeah, I can't remember what it is, yeah. Yeah, I'll tuck it in the car with you, just, just to try, yeah. Yeah, Roger, just to rule that out the microphone, because it, uh, it does sound a bit tunnelly, it's nowhere near... Uh, the audio of mine, you were spoiled with the audio on your, your big radio there, that's what it is. Roger. Well, I can always start the bass mic and put, plug that in as well, to be honest. Um, yeah, that's doable, because you can reverse the cable on this, you know what I mean? So I could swap it around to uh, the RG45. That would be interesting. Roger. Yeah, I could always do that. I could grab the both of them, eh? just as a comparison. Just, uh, you've got me paranoid now with someone up with the radio. <laughs> <laughs> not with the radio. I mean, getting around the world, mate, so it's not that. Yeah, but just, uh, maybe no right on frequency or something there. Um, yeah, okay, yeah, I'll, I'll grab a couple of mics. I'll do that. No, no, it's fine on frequency. I could uh, vouch for that here. Um, but when you're up the law, I do hear that. It's like noise coming behind your modulation, which is on frequency. Oh, yeah. Well, it could be a proximity thing. Like you say, I hear the... You've heard me speak to Koji about it, eh? Like a swirly... Just, uh, uh, that type of, like, wind noise in the background. I get it be like, Bruce, some of the guys, because they're close to me at the back, in the front of Whitfield, in front there, and that. Way in the lane. Loads of these guys that are really close to me, that happens. Hi, uh, Roger. I get that on the big radio, too. Like, you can just knock it up a few on FM. It stops that uh, oscillating noise. Um, yeah, but we're, we're on your mobile here. I know, I know, yeah, um, but I'm just saying the effect is probably similar, because I'm up the wall, you know what I mean, I'm like, I could shout and you'd probably hear me, so you'd probably get that same effect from me in mobile in my car up the wall, how? Yeah, for it's like close proximity again, so is it? But I'll be interested to see how the audio changes with the mic, right? Yeah, that could be experiment. Roger, yeah. and uh, that makes sense as well, because you're saying Davey, Davey's part next to me up the wall, how? So it'd be that proximity thing with him as well. Or either that they're seeing it really well. Yeah. No problem, mate. Well, either that, if it still continues, I'll uh, not the uh, BFO a bit of frequency, see if it changes anything, because I've never actually uh, really noticed. Roger. Uh, okay, well, here we experiment. Right, I'll, uh, I'll just go I'll just go clear on the side. Uh, um, like I said, just got to grab a cup of coffee and make my way to the perch. Okay, so, thanks to uh, 052 scale, come call us, this is uh, 108 Delta Delta 054 representing uh, Sunday District on Perth Air Sunday Net here on the 27305. Any stations anywhere would like to call in, uh, please go ahead. 271. Wow, 271 booming in here. Uh, good afternoon. Good afternoon, who's been watching stuff on TV? Uh, Roger, Matt, what radio is that you're operating there, Coach? That's a good one. Oh, it sounds it. I should can with. Oh, All right, okay. Aye, <laughs> uh, aye. Uh, no, I, I can't use my YouTube because I need my power park back. I've got that one sorted for uh, David Turner. Uh, was he 
nem kell a megnézni, nem
Kraken is on me, great audio. 900 worked really well, so run for it, but it worked well. Frank and our growth there, anybody else hearing him? Is that yourself there, uh, Mike, with 047? Is that you, Andy, 116, Andy? You're in the log. Let's wait till he comes back on station. He's doing a, an adjustment to the radio there. Uh, 108 Delta, Delta 054, uh, giving a call for the Dundee District and Perth of Sunday Net there. Any stations anywhere would like to call in, please uh, go ahead.
Rangers. Okay, Rangers. Who makes that then? I'm writing that down. I'll need to check that out. Is that what you're operating right now? Thank you. 